Here at the NFL Combine in Indianapolis, I'm Aaron Summers alongside Saints defensive end Cam Jordan. Mm -hmm. Does this take you back to when you were here? No, it does not. No? There's nothing about this that makes me want to come back uh, to 2011 uh, here, right here at the Combine, where you know coaches probe you and ask you weird questions that don't really pertain to football, but could. They're trying to like gauge your, your mindset and mentality. It was a time, and I've forgotten about it. What would be a question that you would ask if you were on the other side? Uh, I, I'd want to know, like, do, how involved are they in their communities? Uh, that would be the, the adult me now. Um, if I take myself back a couple of years, I want to know what is it that coaches actually gain from asking random questions that don't amount to anything pertaining to football. You're going to be here, a part of the NFL Network coverage down yeah, there yeah. on the field. Boom. What are you looking for? Uh, my next D-tackle. I mean, but that's just me. Again, being biased here. Uh, I feel like if we draft another D-tackle, then we have to, you know, probably like not a next D-tackle, a first or second rounder, which means we probably have to put him on the field next year, which means then we have a 4-3 four, on four, fourth down, or third down. And uh, I could get excited about that one. You know, we add in Peyton Turner and we add myself in and Carl Grandison. And then we just run a 5-1 something. You know, it'd be five D linemen down, Demario blitzing, and have, you know, our, our secondary doing what they do. That's your ideal look for the defense there. It's my dream look. I don't know <laughs> if it's ideal. I don't know how successful and or not so successful it could be. What are you looking forward to as a whole for the season upcoming? I mean, come on. If we're talking about what am I looking forward to, Derek Carr being with the Saints for the second year, that's normally where you see his biggest leaps. Um, I love the idea that we have potential, but I hate the idea that we have potential as well. I don't want potential. I want realized gains. How do you get that? <laughs> I'm trying to figure that out. If I, if I had that answer, I'd have multiple Super Bowl rings. Um, but that's, that's the idea. We're, we're in the hunt. Uh, and it starts April, what is that, 13th with voluntary workouts. And we'll move on from there. We, 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 I'd love to see everybody show up. Um, I'd love to see all full participation. And that's where our camaraderie starts. It's not so much the workouts. It's not the grind. It's the ability to be around each other, familiarize yourselves with your teammates. Um, of course, I'm always going to be around my D-line some way, somehow. Uh, but just going on and building that brotherhood. Because when you trust somebody, you want you know you push yourself that much harder uh, to go even deeper, hopefully, into the playoffs this year. If you had an opportunity to talk to some of the players here, what would you tell them about the Saints to try to? Well, I'll have plenty of opportunities, and it's the same. It's the same idea, you know. If if you get a call from the Saints, pick up. Um, that being said, we're in a win now mentality, as well as to any even just the kids that are here. You know, first of all, it's an honor to be here. There's 300 kids that get invited here. I don't know how many D1, D2, D3 schools, NIAIs there are, uh, but there's tens probably probably in the tens of thousands of kids that play football a year that don't have this opportunity so you figure you, your your childhood dream is to be in the nfl and this is the one of the last steps that you have before the draft so go out there and enjoy each and every moment give it give it your best and leave it all on the field i mean if your film hasn't done the talking for you then it's not like this will do the talking for you so this is just a cherry on the ice cream what's your favorite event I mean, I feel like everybody's is the 40, right? Because you can be like, oh, he's so fast. I mean, the combine, again, is just numbers. I want to see your game film. I want to know if you're a dog or not. But this, this gets, you know, the analytics talking. This gets the, the, the numbers guys talking. You know, if you see a, a, a DB run sub 4-3, you, you think he can keep up with everybody. If you see a, a nose tackle run sub 5 over 340 pounds, you probably start drooling like, oh, that big guy can move. I'm all about game film. But this, again, this is the finishing of the show, the finale, if you will. And we're not going to see you out there running any drills? No. <laughs> <laughs> I'd, I'd hope not. But, I mean, you know, I don't think I'm in the right, the right footwear for it. I got heat on my feet and not, not the, uh, the cleats on the feet. So. All right. Thanks for taking the time and enjoy. Indeed. What are you looking forward to? How about that, Miss Erin? This is the highlight of my time here. I appreciate that. No, yeah. Solid rep right there.